Let's check in with Angela Foster. She's been keeping us up to date on all the alternate routes. Angela. Vic, on the alternate routes that we have been giving you, we are still finding other ways for you to get around these closures. I just want to quickly remind people, although Quarantine Road, Hawkins Point Road, on that Curtis Bay side, that is your route that will get you off of the Beltway. There is no access from Quarantine Road and Hawkins Point Road to the Beltway. Your ramps are going to be completely blocked. Also, we've been mentioning some of these other roadways you can use. Fort Smallwood Road comes up a lot because a lot of people will use that. But just remember, as a result of everything that is happening, no access to the park right there at Fort Smallwood in that vicinity. Meanwhile, we want to work you into some alternates for those who are traveling northbound 95 coming through Howard County. And if you cannot go through the tunnels, but you'd like to go through the city, just take 395 north northbound from Interstate 95. If you turn right on 395 at Pratt Street, that will take you over to the Jones Falls Expressway by taking a left on President Street. And of course, the Jones Falls Expressway 83, you'll take that north to 695 and get you around to 95 in the Rosedale area. That's just one of the routes we are giving you this morning. But for now, we're going to go outside to Janae Reese. She's in our mobile unit giving us more updates on the roadways. Good morning, Janae.